Happy birthday to you. Welcome to my 23rd birthday glow up. Hi guys, my name is Edith, if you guys didn't already know, and today I'm glowing up. I am turning 23 years old. For the first time in my adult life, I felt like I should celebrate in some way. I always am super low-key about my birthdays. I always just try celebrating at my parents' house with like a little birthday cake and maybe just a dinner at their house. But this year, I really wanted to do something a little bit different. And since I am going through like my peaceful era and also my hobby, era if you watch my channel let me do something that I enjoy doing with my family still so I want to go hiking in Joshua Tree you guys know I am starting to pick up the hiking habit and just being outdoor in nature so we actually haven't booked the Airbnb yet I have to get that done today but I do have to look cute so I'm gonna go get an eyelash fill right now and of course for the birthday glow up we are gonna make sure we glow up internally as well so later on in the day we're gonna go to the gym that's why I have like this outfit on I honestly feel like I'm still like 21 mentally so for our birthday glow up for sure there is one thing that i for sure want to do and that is cutting my hair i mean i guess it's a myth or whatever but supposedly hair holds memories all that stuff i want to cut it because it's really damaged and not only do i want to glow up for my birthday but start the new year off right my birthday's in january so it's perfect because i turn a little bit older a little bit wiser and i'm starting fresh with the new year so i want to start fresh a new birthday and a new year with healthy hair and i might dye it a different color or a little bit brown to just match my roots for sure we need to get rid of the old memories the old actually last year was a really good year for me could there have been improvements yes but it was pretty good anyways join me for my 23rd birthday glow up we're gonna do my nails cut my hair tone my hair fill my eyelashes work out internally maybe do some new year goals actually this year i'm gonna write myself a letter for 24 year old edith aka next year edith oh my god that number sounds so weird to say because i'm 22 right now i'm like 24 next year. Anyways, let's go get a fill for my lashes. It's lashes time. We just made it to our lash by that. It's okay, here's the full four. They're looking pretty good, honestly. Not too bad. We're gonna make them look even better. Lash appointment check, you guys. My lashes came out so, so freaking wispy, just like I like them. Now, we have to go look for a birthday outfit because I need something to wear on my birthday. So, we're gonna go to the mall real quick. I think I'm not gonna be able to go to the gym today because it's 4 p.m. and my class is scheduled for 6 <laughs> tomorrow. Best believe we're going to the gym, baby. We're going with my trainer. Whoop our butt cheeks. Birthday outfit loading right now. All right, we made a quick pit stop for some lunch, brunch, dinner. Whatever you want to call it, but chicken panini with a Caesar salad. We're gonna devour this and then go shopping. When your hubby opens your door, aw. All right, it's finally shopping time. It's already kind of dark outside. It's a vibe, though. Yeah, it is a vibe. Where are we going first, baby? <laughs> It is day two of this glow up and today we're starting off the day right with a workout. We woke up bright and early today taking out my Eternal Muse hair curler. I actually got a new one in the mail yesterday. This one's like a little bit of a thicker... <laughs> What is this called? Roller thing, whatever. And then two new scrunchie. We will see how it looks. But I am gonna put my hair up because on Monday I went cycling with my hair down and it was really not a vibe. I was miserable the whole time. But here is the OOTD. The camera's just rolling. Morning, chicken. Let's go have a bomb workout. I think we're gonna do leg day or full body with my trainer, Carla. What baby? What baby? What baby? <laughs> but yeah. Let's get a bomb workout, start the day off right, because today I'm gonna fix this mess of a hair. Finally gonna get it cut today and toned, probably brown. So say bye to this precious hair. I love it so much, but I just can't keep it if I wanna go for the more natural and damage-free hair. <laughs> All right, let's go. Oh. Yeah. Woo! Ah! That was 
such a bomb workout. Let's take a shower. I'm gonna wash my hair, my body. Let's get ready for our hair appointment. Oh my god, the water's getting super duper hot. Before I show you guys my hair appointment, I am so excited to tell you guys that Skims sponsored today's video once again. I love Skims so much. And if you are new around here, Skims is actually creating the new generation of bras and underwear for everybody. Ever since I tried them back in September for the first time, I have been obsessed. They're so comfortable. They look so nice. Skims bras are made with innovative technology to give you the best shape and support. I literally can't feel like I'm wearing anything right now. I'm actually wearing the push-up bra. No lie, this bra lives rent-free on me. But I'm actually trying out two more pieces this time around. I have this baby right here. This one is unlined. I'm also trying out a black one. This is the wireless form push-up lunge bra. They are the comfiest and have the softest material. Materials, so I literally feel like I'm not even wearing a bra So all of those times when I would come home and immediately take off my bra are literally nowhere in sight Where are they? <laughs> my bra is just my baby now Scams of bras are also now available in 62 sizes from 30A to 46H You can get Skims bras at skims.com And you can get free shipping on orders over $75 And as you guys know, Valentine's Day is right around the corner So if you're looking for a gift for your Valentine or for your Skins just launched their best Valentine's shop ever, also available at skins.com. So believe the Skims hype, y'all. They have over a hundred thousand five-star reviews for a reason. And like always, if you haven't already, let them know that I sent you guys. It would really, really help this girly out. After you place your order, select YouTube in the survey, and of course, click my name to let them know I sent you. Ah, thank you so much, Skims, for sponsoring today's video. Now let's go get my hair done. Makeup is done, and I dried my hair. I am on my way to my appointment with four minutes to spare. That's actually really good. At least I'm not running late, but I am running a little bit close to schedule. So hopefully we don't get lost and find the salon fast because I am going to a new salon today. But yeah, I am super excited. This is the last time you guys are going to see me with this hair. But actually it might fade into this in the near future. So don't worry. It's going to look a little bit like this. Hopefully, I don't know. I'm walking in there with zero expectations because I just want to have healthy hair and I'm going to go with whatever I have to do to achieve it, you know? So... I for sure will come out with so much less hair. It's gonna be a lot shorter and then it looking a lot darker. This is my official before headshots. <laughs> Cut. Oh my gosh, I love. Hair is gonna pick me up. Hey girl, hey. You look so good. Oh, thanks, my love. It's really short, huh? It is, but I low key love it. Oh, the color. Do you think it's like a major change or no? Not really, huh? Not really, but you could tell. It looks like a chocolatey brown. Yeah, but you can still see kind of. Like yes, the red, a little huh? bit of red. Yes. I think I love how it looks with like, like my it. skin tone. It is pretty short. It's so short. But it is soft. It this so is 23. What do you mean it's 23? I'm gonna be 23. Oh, I was like, what do you mean? Okay, right, we're gonna try this boba place out. Ooh, strawberry slushy with cheese foam. Okay, I got his slushy, so let's try it out. Is it like the best out of all of them that you've drank before? We're walking in the little city or like the little downtown where I got my hair done. It is honestly such a beautiful town. I really want to come back and explore a little bit more. I have a nail appointment after this though, so we got to leave. I have no nail inspo. I have one nail inspo, but I'm not sure if my nail tech can do it. Because last time I asked her, she didn't do it. But I'm going to ask her if not. I don't have a plan B. Ricardo was like, what's your plan B? And I was like... I don't have one. <laughs> so I have about an hour to decide. But the strawberry matcha was actually so good. I think it's one of the best ones I've ever tried. So I'm definitely coming back for sure. At least for the matcha. Oh my gosh. I'm feeling like a new woman, baby. We came to the mall. We're going to do some quick shopping since yesterday was unsuccessful. Oh my gosh. I love this dress. It's giving. Let's go on a brunch date or a picnic. It has a little slit. Okay, yeah. I think this is going to be my birthday outfit. Ugh. I would call that a successful shopping spree. Nothing. Like yesterday, today's was so successful. I actually hadn't came to Hollister in a while. Like I haven't shopped at Hollister. And I'm actually super surprised at the sizes, the design, and everything. I used to be like a Hollister lover before. And for some reason, I just stopped. But like, I think I'll be a Hollister lover again. Anyways, we are going to head out. Oh my god, my mother. 
matcha. This matcha was literally so delicious. I still have no nail inspo design. For you have I 30 have minutes. No... Mm -hmm. 30 minutes to uh. decide on an inspo. Okay, I'm gonna take this 30 minute ride to the nail salon to check out nail designs and see what I want. So now that I know what dress I'm gonna be wearing, now I know kind of what I can. Actually, I'm gonna do French tip for sure. Like that's my fave. But like I don't know what length and what color of French tip. So we will decide. All right, guys, it's the next day. I finished getting my nails done, and I never showed you guys because it was already late by the time I got out of the salon, but it is the next day. It's actually minutes before my birthday today. We just spent the whole day cleaning outside, and Ricardo cleaned a little bit last night. He's cleaning up a little bit right now, so we have everything clean. Tomorrow is officially my birthday. Well, in like 10 minutes, it's officially my birthday, so I do need to go to sleep early. I did have an appointment for my eyebrows, but my girl canceled because she's in Mexico and she wasn't able to make it back on time so i didn't get my eyebrows laminated so they're just gonna be bushy for it, my birthday but it's okay because i'm just gonna try to like use my little razor and clean them up a little bit i am so obsessed with my hair still though i put in the hair rollers from eternal muse that i always put on so i've always used these ones this is like a thinner one i just bought these new ones so i was able to use them right after i got my hair done i put them in and i woke up this morning this has been my hair for the past like 12 hours it it literally looked like I had like a blowout. My hair feels so short, but at the same time, I love it. I posted a Instagram picture or an Instagram reel yesterday. Like, this is your sign to cut your hair because people think hair holds memories and emotional weight and stuff like that. A lot of people were like, oh my gosh, like I was waiting for this sign and stuff. So if you haven't cut your hair and you have dead ends, like make this your sign. Cut your hair. It feels so soft and it hasn't really been getting that tangled at all. Like literally, I haven't brushed my hair all day and I can do this before I would barely even like not even be able to put my fingers in my hair because it would be so tangled and I love the color I think I'm gonna have this color for a little while reddish but like darker like chocolate brown more rich this is the last part of my birthday glow up tomorrow I don't have anything special planned out at the beginning of the video I had said that I had a trip planned which I was originally gonna go to Joshua Tree with my family and stay in an Airbnb but I decided that I actually just wanted to stay at home and kind of see what happens my birthday just like wake up have a cute outfit go for brunch and see just what happens and instead save up that money from the airbnb for a trip on a train <laughs> that i've actually been wanting to do for a long time but the rooms are actually like a thousand dollars one way like it's a lot more expensive to travel that way than it is on the airplane so i think tomorrow should be fun and i really want to remind myself that it's not about what you do but it's about the people you surround yourself with your mentality about things like yesterday i had such a good day after i got my hair and like i felt such a confidence boost i felt so motivated inspired and i was like oh my gosh i am about to be one year wiser one year more mature and i just feel so grateful to be able to grow old because not everybody gets to grow old you know but anyways enough of my little ramble because it is 11 56 it is four minutes before i am officially 23 years old i'm no longer gonna be 22 this is the outfit that i ended up buying i showed you guys yesterday in the last clip this dress like this looks horrible but on the body it kind of actually looks a little bit more flattering i'm gonna wear it tomorrow i got my nails and my toes oh my god that's another thing i need to ramble about <gasps> the girl that did my toes well first of all i got my toes and my feet done at the same time that's why i wasn't really able to record because i had a spa treatment but i got everything done in like two hours i usually go get my nails done in one salon my feet in another salon so it takes so long and yesterday only took two hours i'm gonna be able to have the toes out for the dress tomorrow i'm gonna take a shower and i'm gonna finish off the night right a letter to myself for next year i really want to start doing this a tradition i think i just want to write down maybe a couple of goals but not really because it's not like new year's but it really is because for me it's like new year's and my birthday same month and they're only two weeks apart so maybe a couple of goals and maybe a couple of inspiring words for myself next year because i genuinely feel like i'm in such a great spot this year it's 11 58 looking back on this whole week i got my eyelashes done this is the best i think i've ever liked my eyelashes i got my hair colored i love this color so much I got my hair cut. I love the cut because my hair feels so soft and I got rid of all of the old energy from toxic stuff or just in general bad things I've gone through or good things I guess and I got a really cute outfit for tomorrow. I have plans and I am about to write myself a letter for next year. Life is great and I'm so happy to be living another year and it is 12 a.m. <laughs> it's my birthday. Ah! Oh. <laughs>
Happy birthday to you. You scared the shit Happy out of me. Happy birthday Where to you. Oh, Happy baby. birthday, dear baby. Oh, Happy birthday to you. Thanks, my love. Oh. 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 You scared the shit out of me, babe. <laughs> Sweet. Mm. Why is that good? Mm -hmm. It got just icing. <laughs> oh, that was too kitty. It's officially my birthday. Let's hop in the shower so we can glow up, smell better. I'm gonna shave everything my arms, my legs, and I'm for sure gonna use a really nice smelling body wash. So, yeah, let's go hop in the shower. Another one. Thank you. Turn on the hot water, please. Thank you. I'm gonna take one of the hottest showers of my life. I love scorching hot showers, and I deserve it because it's my birthday. Ah! <laughs> Fresh out the shower, baby. And before I go to sleep, I obviously have to put in the hair curly because I want to wake up tomorrow morning. Luscious hair. But let me show you guys all the products I use so that my hair does turn out good in the morning. So obviously, you need your Eternal Muse heatless curler thing. And then I've actually been super into Living Proof. Recently, I used to use the Living Proof um, dry shampoo when I first had my hair blonde two or three years ago. I stopped purchasing it. I don't even know why, but recently they sent it to me in PR again. And I just remembered why I loved it so much they also sent me the texture spray which i have never tried before and i freaking love and then they also sent me this vanishing oil which i'm literally showing it to you guys because i love it this much but i feel like all of these products combined make my hair come out in the morning so so beautiful and then i go in with the dry shampoo this is the advanced clean one and I put a little bit of texture spray in, but I really do this in the morning more than anything. And hair curler thing is going in. I hate that I don't know the name of it. Okay, I have my little journal here, but I've never been much of a journaler and I really want to start on you know that girl because I was reading through some of the journal entries I have in here and I was like, hmm. I love like being able to see back on what I was thinking of last year or a couple months ago even. I'm gonna sit down here and take a couple of minutes right on here, reflect on this year. I think one of the biggest gloves for me this year has been mentally and even for this video, I think that it's one of the biggest gloves because although physically it does make me feel a lot more confident to look a certain way, mentally in knowing that I am a year wiser and everything that I learned while I was 22, everything I went through and even like nice experiences i went through i can reflect back on that take note of what i want to do this year when i'm going to be 23 and just be grateful for everything that i have gone through this whole year so yeah let's take a couple to glow up and write my letter to my future self Here is a letter Ricardo's gonna hide it from me so that I don't open it myself, which I I don't think it would, but here we will see you next year. It is 12.38. I am about to go to sleep. And this was my glow up for my 23rd birthday. I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I hope you guys take a little bit of how I did this for your birthdays as well. I love you guys so much. And I will see you guys in my birthday vlog. Because I'm filming everything tomorrow. And see what goes on. Big goal for my 24th birthday. 24th. 23rd birthday. Don't get ahead of yourself at it. Have fun with your loved ones. And just have a good day. Alright guys. Bye.